her voice. Today we have an old British talent who has already conquered the USA with her outstanding performances. Emma King, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Hi. Hello, thank you for having me. How are you? I'm very well today. Yeah. A bit windswept, but I'm good. <laughs> That's great. It's great, great to have you here. Oh, um, how does it feel to join the uh, Her Voice project? I'm really excited because I know I'm about to find out a lot of information that even probably I don't know, so I'm quite excited. Oh, okay, that's great. <laughs> uh, well, about information that you don't know, I, I don't know if you know that, but um, I have a couple of uh, news about the uh, inequality, uh, the, the, the gender gap that mm -hmm. unfortunately is in the music industry, in the entertainment industry, but music industry in particular. Um, if you think that only three women have won uh, the Mercury Prize in 22 years, uh, it, this That's is just, surprising. yeah, absolutely, absolutely. And only 14% of the Performing Rights Society members are women. Really? Yes. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Fourteen. Mm -hmm. So, um, so do, do, do you do you find yourself getting compared um, exclusively to female artists normally? I usually do, but I was actually surprised um, this week. Uh, the Blues magazine actually compared the music and my sound to Fleetwood Mac, which is obviously a mixed oh, yeah. bag, which never That's usually nice. happens. But on the whole, I'd say it's usually women that you are compared to. Okay. Okay, so uh, can, can you tell me a moment uh, in your, during your career where you felt that you were being treated differently because you were, you, you're a female artist? The only thing that I can really think of at this moment is a time when um, I was doing a music video and it was kind of uh, people saying perhaps what you should do and what you should wear in order to get more views on a video. or and it's almost going against something that you're not, because obviously, as you can see, I'm all about extra layers. I dress like winter all year round. So, to you know, someone to suggest you know wearing a see-through shirt, perhaps, or you know, even a bra. I don't know. I, it's just you know, these yeah. things happen in the industry, and you know, it is something that is quite concerning. You turn on MTV now, and there is a lot of um, just women without. Them, yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So yeah, unfortunately, uh, I noticed also with other um, female artists that we had on the show yeah. that they or uh, they get compared. They, their art is described more as sexy than, you know, basic their 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 the judgments on the talent, the actual yeah. talent. Yeah. So. The, did you ever happen to you? I think perhaps I've people have said in the past when describing describing the voice that maybe you know seductively soulful or you know sexy vocals, okay. which perhaps doesn't happen as much with male artists. Yeah. Um, so that has happened to me a couple of times, definitely. Okay. But um, do you think that looking from a different standpoint, mm. uh, does being a female help sometimes in the in the industry? I think definitely years ago, I'm sure a lot of women, and you, you do hear stories that they do use it to their advantage, but I can't say that as of yet I've experienced that personally. Okay, okay, okay. so um, and if you had unlimited power okay. to change the industry, the situation in the industry, what yeah. would you do? If I could do anything, yeah. I'd probably make it um, a more fair playing field and you know, make it financially possible for everyone of all talents and make sure the people that make it, it's the ones that are just as hard working and dedicated rather than any other, you know, yeah. scenario. Yeah. So that would be nice in an well, ideal yeah, world. That would be great. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, okay, let's say that tomorrow you are offered one billion pounds. Okay. Ooh, that would be Contract. nice. Okay. <laughs> but, okay. <laughs> You have absolutely no control over the, <sighs> the music and the art that you will um, right. deliver or produce. So, so I have to make accept. a decision. Yeah. Okay. You know, it is a tough one because definitely in the past I've been in um, contracts and scenarios where I haven't had that much control and it is very restrictive. And I'm kind of in a position now where I have a lot of freedom and I'm able to kind of really explore that and I'm enjoying it. So. Oh, it's a tough one, but I probably would go with, you know, having the control and being able to, to, you know, do what you actually want to do and you set out to do originally. That's quite an important thing to do. So you would to try do. to negotiate. I would try <laughs> yeah. to negotiate. I would try to negotiate. So uh, your inspiration, your female inspiration, like a woman 
Yeah. Uh, not not particularly a singer or an entertainer, but okay. there is one that really inspired you. Okay, well, this sounds this might sound a bit soppy, but it probably would be my mum because all the way through my career and all the way through my life, she's always, you know, drilled home to always do the right thing and always follow your gut instinct and. You know, she's just a, an unbelievable woman. And she did start off singing as well, so she was my very first, you know, she's the first person I heard singing. And she's, yeah, she's a great role model. She's wonderful. Great. And that's always great to hear that. <laughs> so describe your age day. What, what do you do? Do you write every day? Do you, how do, you do music? Okay, uh, well, I'm an independent artist right now, so pretty much... Um, when you're an independent artist, you want to take on the role of everything. So, you know, it's doing all the admin, it's booking in shows, it's doing the tours, it's writing whenever you can find the time to write, you know. So it's, it's pretty full on, um, but it, it's great. I wouldn't change anything for the world. It's, it's, it's all good. You're living the dream. I yeah. am. Yeah, I'm enjoying it. <laughs> have you ever done anything that you regret in your career? I don't think I have. I, th I think everyone has moments when something goes wrong and at the time you think, why did I do that? But I think I wouldn't be where I am now, writing the music I am now, without those awful things happening. So I try not to regret anything that's, okay. that's happened. Okay, okay. And uh, what are you doing at the moment? Tell me more about you, because I know there's an album out. There is. There. It's yeah. very exciting. Oh, um, I really like the I, I really like music. It's oh, really thank you. It's fresh, but it's also very much country pop but in a in a very catchy way and oh thank you it gives good energy oh yeah, thank you oh yeah. well that's it really, good it really puts me in a good mood oh i'm pleased yeah. to hear that thank you yeah. Uh, well yeah well that comes out on may 27th um, so I'm quite excited about that. The, um, we've also got an acoustic tour coming up in June as well. Mm -hmm. uh, so that's going to be June and July. So we'll be on the road promoting the record. In UK? Uh, yep, and Scotland and Wales as well. So yeah, so it's all uh, it's all happening. It's all, all fun. Wow. wow <laughs> it's wow, going wow. well. So where's the uh, album available? Is it available on uh, iTunes? And yeah, everything? you can yeah. pre-order it now on Amazon and Google Play and iTunes. So okay. it's all kind of there, ready to go. Okay. Yeah, that's great. Thank you. And uh, yeah, how about because I know you're on the team, but I, I need a proof actually. Oh so goodness. Okay. <laughs> so would you sing something to me? Yeah. Just, um, whatever you feel like. Just something from the album, maybe just a little yeah. line. Oh yeah. Okay. Absolutely, yeah. Okay. Oh. Baby, let's just fall living. Not forgiving my time to you. Woo! <laughs> That's great. Thanks very much. You're Thank very you. welcome. Thank really you. It was really great to have you here. Thank Thanks you for much. having me. Thank you. Bye. Bye. <laughs>